In keeping with tonight's nostalgia theme, I think we should pause for a moment and think back all the way to the beginning of this show. <laughs> Screen actors saw signs of an ominous trend in film casting last year when several writers put on makeup. Norman Mailer in Ragtime, Faye Keenan in Rich and Famous, Jerzy Kosinski and George Plimpton in Reds. All are now eligible for consideration as best writer in a supporting role. Happily, there is no such category. More happily, the author of the current novel, Pinball, who last year adapted his bestseller, Being There to the Screen, is here to present writing awards. The distinguished author and part-time actor, Jerzy Kosinski. My experience as an actor has taught me the importance of a writer. We who act owe so much to those of us who write. <laughs> the Bible tells us that in the beginning was the Word. When the universe was in complete disorder, Moses was called to the mountain. A warning bolt of lightning, an overture of thunder, the skies parted, and a mighty hand reached down to give Moses the stone tablets. That was the first script. Some critics thought it was overproduced for just 10 lines. But, but by following it, mankind restored order out of disorder. If succeeding generations had stuck to that original script instead of ad-libbing around it so much, this would be a better world to live in. The original script nominated this year as best screenplay written directly for the screen are Absence of Malice by Kurt Latke, Arthur by Steve Gordon, Atlantic City by John Guare, Chariots of Fire by Colin Welland. And Reds by Warren Beatty and Trevor Griffiths. I admire all of you, and the winner is Colin Welland for Chariots of Fire. done for the British film industry. <laughs> I'd just like to thank David Putnam for having the wisdom to ask me to write it in the first place, Hugh Hudson for respecting me and my script, which is a very hard thing to find in our business, as you know, all the actors for getting fit enough to appear like Olympic athletes, and to British television, where I learned my craft. I'd like to finish with a word of warning. You may have started something. The British are coming. <laughs>